personal space with us in the classroom. We have some new students and some of our students, we keep going into everybody else's personal space, right? So one of the things I've noticed is she's got great energy in the classroom. She's got patience, she's empathetic, and she's got great listening skills. These skills often impact, or they do impact, her children, but most especially, they impact the whole family. With her experience as a BSC teacher and her knowledge and behavior, she's always willing to go into the classes, observe, give teachers different ways to set up the classroom or different ways to uh, manage that behavior. She's always even willing to give us all her little fidget toys that she has. Mrs. Rodriguez taught me how to be a good friend. Today we are learning about feelings and we are making emotions. They are like excited or happy and then like you are cold. It makes, it makes me happy. I like about Miss Rodriguez because she's very nice. She's very, very, very helpful and she's the best teacher. I'm gonna never forget her. I learned about feelings of happy, sad, and mad, and scared, and surprised. You're the teacher of the year, yay! Miss Aranisa not only has the ability to cover all the standards and the rigor that is required in the classroom, she also provides each student with exactly what they need and what they require. Ms. Rodriguez is also always willing to give up her time in order to help us. If we have any questions, if we have any doubts, she's always willing to clarify. She's always willing to make some time out of her day or even stay after school in order to help us out. Thank you, Ms. Rodriguez, for showing me up about my emotion, about my feelings. I hope you have a good time. I never forget you. Thank you for making me a good listener. And with help with you and my parents, and, and I'm, glad, I'm glad you're a teacher in the year. Ms. Rodriguez, you are truly an amazing teacher. Desert Trail Elementary is super lucky to have such a knowledgeable, dedicated, and caring teacher. Thank you for supporting our students and for supporting our teachers. I hope you're enjoying your evening and you are feeling celebrated. Aranisa, congratulations. I am so proud of you and this is so well deserved. Have an awesome evening and really enjoy yourself. My name is Angelique Criosa. I'm in fourth grade. I go to Berino Elementary. Ms. Lopez was my kinder teacher. What makes Ms. Lopez a fantastic teacher is that she would make learning fun and make me feel excited to come to school. My name is Rocio Casas. I'm a sixth grade teacher at Berino Elementary. Mrs. Lopez is an incredible teacher because everything she does, she does it with the children in mind. She is their greatest advocate and she holds them to the highest of expectations. Her knowledge of curriculum, growth mindset, uh, classroom discipline, and management allows her students to meet those expectations or even sometimes exceed. My name is Marco Gamis. I'm in kindergarten at Barino Elementary. She helps us and she gives us a recess. She makes learning fun and I love her. My name is Genesis Van Andra and I go to Barino Elementary. Ms. Lopez makes learning fun. She teaches us to work and teaches us how to be kind. She helped me with reading. Ms. Lopez, congratulations, I love you. You are 
You are smart. I am pretty. You are pretty. I am strong. You are strong. I'm a winner. You are a winner. My name is Wendy Rios. I work here at Verino Elementary. I am uh, in partnership with Victoria Lopez in the kinder position. What makes Ms. Lopez an amazing teacher is that she grew up here in the community. She graduated from Gadsden High School, so she knows the community really well. I think some of her strengths is that she's very knowledgeable, she's bilingual, and she has great rapport with not only the students, but the parents as well. Victoria, congratulations. I truly am happy that you, you got this recognition and I hope that one day, you know, you work at central office to be a leader and, um, you know, for the good of the community. Thank you, Ms. Lopez, for the things you taught me. Congratulations for winning Teacher of the Year. You really deserve it. Victoria, I want to congratulate you for being recognized and that bond that you and I share with these students and these families is unbreakable. Again, I congratulate you and thank you for all that you do for our profession. Thank you, Victoria. Love you. My name is Jasmine Acuna. I am a student at Desert Pride Academy. I am in the 11th grade. What makes Ms. Vargas a special teacher is como ella es muy amable. Like she really cares about her students and she's always pushing them to do better. I know she's like my biggest supporter. The American Revolution and how did we gain our freedom and become... My name is Socorro Garcia. I teach high school Spanish. What makes Ms. Vargas a fantastic teacher is that she has developed many, many different strategies and techniques. She's very caring, very responsible, and she's an expert in the classroom. Hi, my name is Jesus Cobos. I'm a senior at Desert Pride Academy. What makes Ms. Vargas such a great teacher is that she always cares for us, even on a personal level, always asks us after the weekend how her weekend was, how we've been. She always cares for us. For example, she's, she always asks how I've been doing with my baby. I'm Sofia Payen, and I'm the assistant principal here at Desert Pride Academy. What makes Ms. Uh, Vargas an extraordinary teacher is that she has really been my go-to person for admintum and ingenuity. This young lady was struggling. Ms. Vargas had been up with this young lady um, all night on Thursday, trying to make sure that this young lady finished her, her ingenuity to, to graduate. She got to graduate because it was Ms. Vargas who helped this young lady uh, with her ingenuity. She stayed with her till seven o'clock in the morning. That is what makes Ms. Vargas an extraordinary teacher and person. If there's something going on in my family, I'll go to Ms. Vargas because I trust her and I know she's gonna give like the best advice. Congratulations, mom. You worked really hard for this, put a lot of years of schooling, a lot of years with students and teachers and everything. Thank you for being my mom and being there when I needed somebody to talk to. Judy, I would like to congratulate you. You have become a, an awesome teacher. You're like my daughter. I'm going to say I'm proud of you, I'm proud of you, I'm proud of you. Congratulations. Ms. Vargas, I want to thank you for everything you've done for us, for all the help, all the encouragement, and everything you helped us go through. Judy, felicidades. You deserve this. Dr. Acosta, he means so much to me. He was the first one who got me into wanting to teach math. I was an IA here at the middle school. He opened his doors to me. He said, you want to teach math? Come with me for a day or two. And since then, he's made the biggest impact on me. All back to Las Cruces. So using your ruler, draw straight lines from Carlsbad to Las Cruces. 
How many miles? Dr. Acosta is a very important figure in the Chaparral community in that he is very dedicated to his students. He always holds their best interests at heart. Dr. Acosta is a very sincere teacher. He helps not only me, but like other students feel confident about themselves. Dr. Acosta really gives his all to whatever he's doing with the students, whether it's in the classroom or it's in during sports or any outside clubs, not just in the classroom. He's such an inspiration. He's an awesome person cool. for Chaparral in general. He's been teaching in this little town of ours for the longest time. So even though he doesn't live in the community, he, he has a big part to do with the community and the students in it. He's participated in helping with the MESA programs. He's done outdoors club. He's tried to bring in a whole bunch of resources for our students to use through NMSU, anything really that, that he can find that'll get this the is, students uh, involved. This is our robotics shop in which the kids have, and parents and New Mexico State and the, the administration has helped us build. Dr. Acosta always strives to go above and beyond. I recall a few years back, he incorporated the language arts component into his mathematics class. He had students use mathematical terms to write poetry, and in turn, he shared them with me. We went ahead and framed them for all teachers to view in the PLC room. There was one time where we were testing about two weeks ago where I felt really nervous. I could feel the tension about having state tests coming up, and it was really difficult for me. But Dr. Acosta was there for me the entire time, not only for me, but for other students. Dr. Acosta really made it easy to feel confident about taking that test. Congratulations, Dr. Acosta. Enjoy your evening. Um, we love you here at Chaparral Middle School. Hey, Dr. Acosta, I just wanted to congratulate you. You deserve this. You've been a really great teacher this year. I wish you the best in everything you do as a teacher, as a coach, even as a mentor. Enjoy your evening. Thank you. Dr. Acosta, I congratulate you on this honor that has been bestowed upon you by your colleagues. You are an asset to this community and always will be. Siga adelante. Mr. Villalobos is a spectacular teacher because he shows up to work early every single day. He works with our most challenging populations. He puts up with me all of the time. He's an amazing student council sponsor. He works well with his peers and his superiors, and he is a role model for me. He is what I hope to be one day. What makes Mr. Villalobos the best teacher I've ever had is that he's, he's been there since I started freshman year to this day now. I've put him through some stuff. I've done some stuff I shouldn't have but he never left my side. He never gave up on me and he never said I'm done. He's always been there. He's been a dad to me. He's been, he's been a family member since day one. Mr. Villalobos is an awesome teacher because he helps me with everything that I go through, like in class. I can say he's the best teacher because he makes me feel comfortable. He jokes around, he's funny, he makes me feel happy at home. Mr. Villalobos is an amazing teacher because he goes above and beyond for his students and staff as well. For example, he makes the students' uh, behavior much better once they leave our classroom. My name is Melissa Baca. I am an IA at Gadsden High School. Hi, my name is Valerie Hart. I teach uh, language arts, uh, primarily 11th grade AP, and I'm a sponsor of the student council here at Gadsden High School. My name is Arun Tovar. I go to Gadsden High School. I am a junior. Hi, my name is Ricardo Jaime. I'm a sophomore at Gadsden High School. Mr. Villalobos, congratulations. Thank you for being there when I call you. and you're always there for me when I need it. Hey, Mr. Villalobos, you totally deserve this. Good job, I am so proud of you. I know you're a part of me too, because I've changed for everything you've helped me with. You totally deserve it. Don't let anybody bring you down. I love you. Thanks for being a father figure in my life. Villalobos, you truly deserve Teacher of the Year. You are a natural born leader, and you make Gadsden a better school. Congratulations, Ganush. I love you so much. If anybody deserves this, it's you. Not only have you been an amazing professional mentor, but I've been lucky enough to have you in my personal life. 
and to help me through some of my hardest times. You are one of the most amazing humans I have ever met in my life, and you deserve this more than anyone I know. Enjoy your night. This is about you. I love you, friend. What makes Ms. Vasquez a fantastic teacher is that she is fun, the patience she has with students, and the, the way she explains things to us. She teaches really well. She always um she always lets us play games on the computer sometimes in our Five, books. Four, three, three, two, one. Okay, when I say objective, what does that mean? Ms. Vasquez is an extraordinary teacher because of the relationships she builds with her students. The learning culture she has established in there allows each and every student to learn from her each and every day. Ms. Vasquez is a great teacher because she's very enthusiastic in her work and she's always willing to help parents as well. So do we problem solve it? Awesome. Thank you, sir. Okay. And you're done with everything? Okay, go get your book from over there. What's this? I think Ms. Vasquez is an astonishing person. She always pays attention to teaching with respect and patience. I remember in second grade when I had trouble with math, she would always help me. She would always try to explain with apples or make it fun. Hey, Hi, my name is Jacqueline Petrello. I'm in third grade in Gaston Elementary School. Hello, my name is Tania Chavez. I'm a sixth grader and I go to Gaston Elementary School. Hello, my name is Carlos Mimbella and I'm in first grade. Hello, I'm Dali Dominguez. I'm a teacher at Gaston Elementary, fourth grade mathematics. Hello, my name is San Juan Atames and I am a teacher for a kinder class in Gazan Elementary School. Ms. Vasquez, I want you to know that I feel happy that I was your student and congratulations for being the teacher of the year. Ms. Vasquez, thank you for being an amazing teacher and congratulations for winning teacher of the year. Ms. Story, congratulations once again. The love and respect you have for your students and the community is inspirational to me. I can't think of anyone more deserving of this award than you. This year you were faced with a, the biggest challenge of your life, and that was facing cancer. And even throughout, you were still there for your students. Dory, you're my hero. Love you, Dory. Ms. Vasquez, you are fantastic. Congratulations for being Teacher of the Year. I love being in your class. I think that what makes Ms. Judge such a strong teacher, it's her uh, knowledge and her experience in working in the classroom. She, she told me that even before she got to college, she went to this um, classes in high school where she would get this exposure, this experience. So she was a teacher even before being a teacher. They're saying something that sounds like they're helpful, but they're not trying to be helpful. They're kind of trying to be me. Miss Judge is an amazing teacher because she makes activities so much fun that she helps us all the time when we need help. Anyone who's a bully, she tells them to stop and she helps um, other kids who need help. What makes Ms. Judge a fantastic teacher is that she's willing to try new ideas. She's willing to help her team and her school in whatever they need. Ms. Judge cares about her students, about their learning and their well-being. She's able to communicate with her families and know them on a personal level. The things that make Ms. Judge the best teacher, I love how she makes learning fun. I can read long words because of her. She makes all of our reading fun. And I love that she gives us time to talk with our friends. And I love her personality.
Okay, hi, my name is Diana Villagrana. I am a first grade bilingual teacher at Desert View Elementary. Hello, my name is Ana Valdez. I am a first grade teacher at Desert View Elementary. My name is Genesis Zapawa. I'm in first grade. I go to Desert View Elementary. Hi, I'm Janae Portillo and I go to Desert View Elementary and I'm in first grade. Ms. Judge, congratulations as being chosen as the teacher of the year for Desert View. Thank you for being a great teacher friend and helping with planning and all the classroom transformations we've done this year. You truly are a wonderful teacher and a friend. Congratulations, Ms. Judge. This is your night, enjoy it, have a good time. You are a really hardworking teacher. I admire you. Not only you're such a strong teacher, a good teacher, you're also a full-time mom. I think you are doing a fantastic job. Congratulations again. I wish you the best. Ms. Judge, congratulations that you got Teacher of the Year. I'm happy for you. I love you. Ms. Judge, I love you. If you, I will miss you when I'm in second grade. Ms. Rosales is a very energetic, fun, and creative teacher. She is amazing because she has so much energy and so much love and so much experience behind her. Ms. Rosales is a super teacher because she tells funny jokes and she makes me feel special. Is an electric cover? What makes her special is that she is a teacher who always smiles, like students to be confident in themselves. I used to walk my cousin into her class. Ms. Rosales would always greet her when she entered. She would always make her feel confident about herself and will make her feel like she belongs in that school. Ms. Rosales is an excellent educator because she cares about the students' academic growth. She understands their journey. She learns their story. She becomes their hero. Students always come back to her because she's always there for them. It doesn't matter what grade they're in, they always come back, knock at her door, and she always greets them with a smile. That's what makes Ms. Rosales an excellent educator. Mrs. Rosales, congratulations. I'm happy to be your friend and remember YOLO. I'm very, very proud of you and I congratulate you. Thank you. Ms. Rosales, I am really proud of you for being the teacher of the year. I know you really deserve it. Thank you, Ms. Rosales. Ms. Rosales, thank you for representing our staff, our students. You make the Riverside community proud. Thank you and enjoy your night. Congratulations. Yeah, you're the special teacher of the year. I love you, Ms. Rosales. Hi, my name is Michelle Dueta. I am a sixth grader at Riverside Elementary. Hi, my name is Santiago. I'm a first grader. My name is Rosa Molina. I teach first grade at Riverside Elementary. My name is Nila Montes. I'm a first grade teacher here at Riverside Elementary. My name is Robert Parra. I'm a first grade teacher at Riverside Elementary. Many things make Mr. Perry a supportive teacher. From day one on this campus, he has welcomed me. He has clued me into how we do things here on this campus. He's very supportive of his students as well. You can see that. He's genuine. He really is interested in their doing well in math. He goes out of his way for that to happen. Tutoring, finding unique ways to introduce or... He's really good at encouraging questions. Never once did I feel uncomfortable when I was struggling or I wanted to ask a question. And he thought of us not just as students, but as people trying to navigate the world around us. His humility as a teacher helps students feel at ease when they need help with something. 
is the way he presents himself in front of his students by the steps that he takes, by the way that he teaches. You can see that he puts a lot of thought into everything that he does. As the students walk into the classroom, it's just a simple little fist bump. And I think that simple little fist bump, it goes a long way in establishing a welcoming environment within Mr. Perry's classroom. Mr. Perry is a caring teacher. He has a, a genuine calling to the profession and you can see it in the way he teaches, in the way he interacts with students. Uh, you did investments, Millionaire Acres 1, Millionaire Acres 2, and they're going to see, I'm going to have you share some of that just a little bit. Not just the students, but as well as his colleagues. He cares, and it's very evident in everything he does. All right. Ashley, why don't you come over here and explain what you got? So, so I started at... At 60, how many? At how 60, I had... When I think of Mr. Perry, I think of the word discipline. As I came out of the pandemic, he was one of my first teachers. He taught me discipline and time management. And thanks to him, I'm able to do all my work in time. And I really want to thank him for that. He, he was such a big impact in my life. I'm just happy to have him as a teacher. Andy, you're the best. And I thank you so much for everything you've done for me and for our students here at AVEX. There's nobody who deserves it more than you do. Mr. Perry, I thank you so much. You've been an awesome big brother to me. I admire your openness, your care, your positivity. You always have had something positive to say, and you always make me smile, and I thank you so much for that. Mr. Perry, thank you so much for being an amazing teacher. Me being a freshman in a class full of upperclassmen, I did feel uncomfortable, but you made sure that I had a place in that. Mr. Perry, I would like to say congratulations. Hi, Mr. Perry. I just want to tell you that not only are you a good teacher, but you're a really good person. You've been kind, you've been humble, you've been respectful to all your students. You have been one of the biggest impacts in my life, and, and I hope you enjoy your evening. So Jesus is a positive te teacher because she always tells us to believe in ourselves and never give up. She makes all of us feel special. So I called Margaret and I told her I had Ms. Rodriguez is a great teacher because she encourages us to try new things and to not give up. Also, what I like about Ms. Rodriguez is that she makes learning fun when we are writing our essays. Ms. Rodriguez is a helpful teacher because whenever we're confused, she helps us with stuff we don't understand and she doesn't make us feel dumb whenever we're asking questions. She makes me feel like a good student. Mrs. Rodriguez is an amazing teacher because she's a very dedicated person. She's one of those teachers who's always looking for new strategies to implement in her classroom. You can see right away that she loves what she does. Ms. Rodriguez is everything that a teacher should be. She wakes up every day with motivation and dedication. Ms. Rodriguez sees her students for who they are and most importantly, for who they can become. Ms. Rodriguez, congratulations on getting Teacher of the Year and thank you for being the best teacher in the world. Thank you for being the best teacher, Ms. Rodriguez. We love you. The braces. Who has braces in the chapter book? Who has braces? Zachary? Margaret. Uh, Liliana Rodriguez, I want to congratulate you. This is something that you deserve. You've inspired me as a teacher. You've mentored me to become a better teacher, and I'm forever thankful for that. It's going to be a great night together. Liliana, on behalf of Loma Linda staff and myself, congratulations on this big recognition. I'm very proud of you. This year, I had the opportunity to work with you, not only as a partner, but you as a teacher with my son, and I saw how much he improved in your class. So I'm very thankful for everything that you do. As I said, it's well-deserved. Ms. Rodriguez, I'm so happy that you got Teacher of the Year, and I'm gonna miss you when I'm in fourth grade.
What makes Ms. Najera such an amazing teacher is that she has this way of teaching that makes it easy for me to learn. She teaches me important things that I'll certainly use later on in life. What makes Ms. Najera an awesome teacher is that she is a very dedicated teacher. She works well with students. She has a great rapport with the students. What I see in her is that she helps the students with their math skills and their reading skills and prepares them for middle school. What makes Ms. Najera such a caring teacher is she's always there for us when we need her. She cares not just for her class, but she cares for other kids too. It was picture day and my hair was looking a bit messy because I had a bow in my hair. And she helped me clip the bow back in and she tucked some hair back for me so I wouldn't look so bad for the picture. And she would do that for other kids too. Oh, Ms. Nahira is just the embodiment of what a terrific teacher should be. She's enthused about her profession. She loves our students. She is a champion for their learning and for dual language. And she is so creative with finding relevant curriculum for our area. She's just fabulous. And remember, if you want it in color, send it to me and I'll print it at home. Ms. Najera, thank you for everything you've done for us. You've taught us to add and subtract decimals, multiply fractions, and important concepts we'll use in life. We will miss you very much when we go to seventh grade, Rem but know that I will always remember you. You're an important part of my life. Ms. Najera, I want to congratulate you for winning Teacher of the Year. I hope you enjoy this evening, and again, congratulations. My dear friend, I could not be any happier than to work with you, to have you as a mentor and simply as a friend. I congratulate you on being Teacher of the Year. Ms. Nahara, you're just an outstanding teacher and I'm really going to miss you when I go to middle school. I'm pretty sure we all are. The two years that you've taught us, you've showed us that you can be an amazing teacher and you've taught us really good things that we're definitely going to need when we're adults. You've let us express ourselves in many ways. It shows that you really care for us and you're always saying that you're very proud of us, that we're very smart kids. And I feel like we can just always rely on you whenever we need you. Thank you. Enjoy your evening. I hope you have an amazing rest of your day. Mr. Madrid, thank you for being a great teacher and making your class a safe space for everyone. And I'll never forget you as a teacher. Hi, Aldea. You deserve this award. Enjoy your night. Bye. Mr. Madrid, c congratulations on your win. I wish you nothing but the best in the rest of your career. And I hope you enjoy your much deserved night at Grace Gardens. Hi, Mr. Richard, congratulations on your award. Thank you for being the best teacher that I ever had. Keep up the good work and enjoy your evening. What makes Mr. Madrid such an excellent teacher is that he really cares for the student. He does a lot for the kids. I know that he targets a lot of his lessons, whether it's for an ESL student like that we share. He shares concerns for them. He makes sure that these kids are getting uh, the accommodations that they need. They, if he has a SPED student, no, regardless of their level, he makes sure in that he provides what he needs to for each one of these students. He also participates in everything that we do in school. He, he usually uh, wins most of the co costume contests, which, you know, it's kind of a bummer because he does so great at that as well. When I was Mr. Madrid's mentor his very first year, I was very impressed with his motivation, with his desire to teach, because he is such a natural teacher. What makes Mr. Madrid a great teacher is that he has the time and the patience for anybody who doesn't understand the lesson he's having. He's a very good teacher, 
If I was a seventh grader, I would take his class again. Mr. Madrid greets us with a smile every day, and he makes all his lessons fun and engaging. Mr. Madrid is always willing to review with kids that need it. I always look forward to going to his class each day because he has something fun and interactive every day. Ms. Muniz is such an awesome teacher because she makes us feel happy. She makes us like follow our dreams. If somebody in our class is having problems or something, she always gets us together to work it out. My favorite part of the day is when Ms. Muniz is teaching us new things. For one, if you are the one in charge of the cup, I need you to grab the marker and the one cup to start coloring. Ms. Moniz is a special teacher because she always helped me out with multiplication. I thought it was hard and division. I thought it was hard. She helped me learn how to multiply and divide to get me ready for the next level. Uh, what makes Ms. Moniz such an amazing teacher is the way she interacts and connects with her students, at the same time maintaining high academic standards. And as a mentee, I really appreciate all the support and guidance that she has provided. What makes Ms. Muñiz such a great mentor is her ability to work with everyone. She finds very creative ways to uh, support us, uh, the students. She's very fun to work with, very engaging. She finds ways to create many more activities for the kids, if it's math, ELA. Ms. Muñiz always finds the time to sit with me, to let me know that everything's okay. And for me, that's very important to have her as a teammate and as a colleague, most important as a friend. What are these? Ms. Muñiz, you are so amazing. It has been such a great pleasure to work with you this year. This is my first year here at Sunrise, and I feel so very fortunate to not only be on the same grade level team as you, but to also have you as my mentor and I'm always gonna remember my first year here at Sunrise because of you. Congratulations, Ms. Muñiz. Enjoy your evening. Thank you for being our Teacher of the Year at Sunrise Elementary. Thank you, Ms. Muñiz, for everything you've done. Congratulations, and I hope you have a great night. Ms. Muñiz, congratulations for being Teacher of the Year. Thank you for being such a good teacher. Ms. Muñiz, I'm very lucky to have you as a colleague. As a friend, you really deserve this. Enjoy it. Please remember you are very loved by your family, friends, and here at Sunrise. What makes Ms. Stern a fantastic teacher is She's always telling us to put in all our effort in all our work and to believe in ourselves. My favorite part of the day is when we start to do math because she's always having fun stuff ready for us to do for math. Greater than five. Greater than five. Three is equal. What makes Ms. Stern an extraordinary teacher is she truly cares of the quality of education she provides for her students. She really goes above and beyond to make sure every one of her students gets everything that they need. She really motivates her students by going the extra mile with little special treats for, like donuts for having perfect attendance, uh, stickers for good behavior. I remember that when we were being good, we would always win a sticker prize on the wall and she would choose our names out out of bin and, she, and we would win fun surprises. Ms. Stern helped organize a school-wide live museum. At first, you know, we all were like, oh, this is huge because, you know, we have so very many third grade students. But once she presented it, we said, wow, let's do it. The students loved it. Parents were very happy to see their, their students, their, their kids presenting, you know, live, you know, with their costume because they all represented. And all third grade students were involved in this activity. During math, we also get to talk to each other a lot. When 
Mr. Let's Talk, it helps me learn better. Miss Lynn is awesome because she would do always fun stuff for us and help us learn a lot. And Miss Talking and Miss Stern, she would always ask me about how my day was or my weekend. She made me feel like she really cared about me. Congratulations, Wendy. Very proud of you. And I'm glad to call you my friend and a colleague. Thank you for all the support over these years, and I hope you enjoy your evening. Miss Stern, congratulations for Teacher of the Year. Have fun. Wendy, congratulations, Mija. You deserve this award as Teacher of the Year. I'm very, very proud of you, and all of us here at Yucca Heights, students, teachers, and administration are very proud of you. Enjoy your evening. You're Teacher of the Year, yay! Congratulations on being the Teacher of the Year this year. Ms. Vasquez helped me to get better at reading because she helped me send out words that were really hard for me. That's how she's a helpful teacher. I've known Ms. Vasquez for 16 years. I first met her back in 2006 when I was her student teacher. Um, so I know her not only as a colleague, I also know her as a student teacher and a mentor. Ms. Ms. Vasquez really cares. She knows when I need a word of encouragement. She really cares. We at Baldwin Elementary are so proud to have Mrs. Vasquez represent our school as Teacher of Tell, the Year. Name the letter that makes that sound. Are you ready? Yeah. Ms. Vasquez made me feel special because when I needed help spelling, she would help me sound out the word and then she would help me spell it. She made me feel confident that I could be hard words. When Mrs. Vasquez visits our classrooms, she brings us strategies. She helps motivate us as, as teachers. She doesn't come in and tell us what to do. She sits with us, she trains us, she models it for us. We know that she's gonna help us. She helps us with our instructional strategies and also provides the resources that we need. Liana, I hope you enjoy your evening. Through your preparation, love and passion, you've earned Teacher of the Year because you inspire hope, ignite imagination, and instill a love of learning. You're an amazing teacher and a great person. Enjoy your evening. Thank you, Ms. Vasquez, for helping me to love reading. Thank you, Ms. Vasquez. Congrats on winning Teacher of the Year. I'll never forget you. Mandy, from the bottom of my heart, congratulations. You deserve this honor. I hope that you enjoy this evening, and I wish I was there to hug you so tight. Love you, my friend. What makes Ms. Guerrero a superb teacher is she bring in new innovative ways with her lessons and getting the kids engaged and the kids are all fired up, excited. One lesson comes to mind is when they do the stock market. And it is amazing to see those kids really, really get into that lesson. And they really, really get so excited. And I see the excitement in her when they finally get how the stock market works. She's very organized. I mean, and she's there for the kids. It's not, it's not for show. Everything that she does, it is done for their kids. And it shines through their kids. And then they digest what it is that he's saying in that song. Because this was after everything. What makes Ms. Guerrero a fantastic teacher is her being very attentive to her students. I always look forward to going to Ms. Guerrero's class because. She's the type of teacher that will make the class a safe place. I really look forward to going because it makes me want to learn. I know that she cares because she has taken the time to get to know me. Miss Quero is one of the best teachers I've ever had because she doesn't just give us notes and all that. She gives us projects. We did a stock market project where we had to buy and sell stocks, and it was a lot of fun. 
I'm really going to miss being in her class, especially with all the fun activities that we do. And she explains the notes really well. She doesn't try and speed it up too much or slow it down too much. She goes just the right pace. Okay. If um, I move further down, I can say it's a melting pot. Miss Kiro, I'm very happy that you got Teacher of the Year. You taught me that I can release some control on my project. I'm really going to miss you next year. Hi, I'm Mary Lish and I am 11th grader at Chaparral High School. My name is Ella Davis. I'm a CTE FACS teacher here at Chaparral High School. I teach life skills, nutrition, and clothing. My name is Ruth Aguilera. Uh, I'm in 11th grade and I attend Chaparral High School. Ms. Del Fuente is the best teacher I ever had because she makes us feel welcome and she always takes care of us. Even whenever we have any drills, she, she always helps us to get through it. She makes me feel safe. As a first year teacher, I know I can rely on Ms. Del Fuente for support and resources. Ms. De La Fuente is a fabulous teacher because she is smart, she is kind, and she is pretty. I really like her energy. She's very energetic. She has those kids dancing, singing, and especially with her Jack. She has Jack on Wednesdays, and they love it. So I have used that in my class. So we love to sing and we like to dance just like Ms. De La Fuente in her classroom. As I had an opportunity to observe Ms. De La Fuente, I noticed that she incorporates positive affirmations into her lessons. My favorite part of being in Ms. De La Fuente's class is whenever we do math and social studies. Working in groups is a lot of fun because um, we're working together and it makes me feel welcome. I remember when I was sad, Ms. La Fuente came and hugged me and she said nice things to me. And I, I, now I know that she loves me very, very much. Ms. De La Fuente, I am glad you got chosen to be our Teacher of the Year this year. And congratulations once again. Uh, I hope you enjoy your day. From the bottom of my heart, God bless. You're awesome. Hi, Ms. Elfenta, congratulations. You deserve to be the, the Teacher of the Year because you're special and you make everyone special. I love you, bye. Ms. Elfenta, congratulations for being the Teacher of the Year. I hope you have a wonderful time and enjoy your gift and your dinner. Ms. De La Fuente, you rock. Congratulations. Enjoy your night. Uh, you deserve this and more. Champagne is such an excellent teacher because he's always there for us and always helping us around the welding shop. He's always making us laugh and stuff, so he's, he's a pretty fun teacher. Uh, I have students who are in his welding class and they're very excited about being part of the class. And some of them were very excited about taking their certification exam and passing it. To me, Mr. Champagne is an extraordinary educator because he cares. Um, he shows positive attitude towards his students and what they accomplish, their achievements, and he takes a good deal of pride in that. His attitude is very contagious, and that carries over into the classroom, into the school, and through the students themselves. 
I had him for two years and I'm learning a lot about welding from him. I have a welding with my friends and we're always learning cool things with champagne and he's always cracking jokes, which makes it a great welding experience. Uh, all the teachers and everyone in this campus knows Champagne and he, they know he's willing to help anyone that's in need or anything like that. The vertical uphill, like you guys have been running stringers, right? Just straight up beats. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna do this weave, it's a box weave. Start the arc, let the electrode burn. We're gonna move up and over and hold. And then from there, we're gonna move up and over and hold. It's a crisscross. It's an up and over. I've had champagne for three years, and always I'm looking forward to going to his class to learn something new about welding. Champagne's most important stuff is safety first. Helmet, safety glasses, and the gloves, because something can get in your eye. He's always yelling at us, but at the same time, he's laughing. And I know he cares about us. Mr. Champagne, muchas felicidades. You are Santa Teresa's Teacher of the Year. It is very well deserved, and I hope you enjoy your evening. And congratulations, Mr. Champagne, on your award as Santa Teresa High School's Teacher of the Year. It is well earned, and I know full well that you'll enjoy the perks that comes with it. Champagne, congratulations for being the Teacher of the Year, and I know I'm going to use the skills that you have taught me throughout my lifetime and just enjoy the night. I would just want to thank you since you always been there for me all these three years. I've come a pretty long way not knowing how to weld and I weld pretty good now. I want to thank you. This is your night. Have fun and eat a lot. Thank you. Ms. Ocello is a great teacher because she's really funny and nice. She's really great and she's a very hard worker and I very much believe that she deserves this award. The message, what are we saying the message of the letter? Like whatever you're talking about. Like the question. Whatever the letter is. Ask like questions. The topic. You can ask questions in the body, very good. Ms. Salcedo is a wonderful teacher. She gives her best. She gives her undivided attention. She gives her personality. She gives her affection and love to students day in and day out. Ms. Salcedo really makes me feel at home because she's really nice and caring and she always helps us out when we really need it. Ms. Salcedo makes learning so much fun. She, she helped me love to read because whenever I used to hate reading because I would always make a mistake and then she helped me recover from my mistakes. Okay, learning about. What would you tell a first grader they're gonna be learning about? She teaches us a lot about writing and we do a lot of different writing pieces like friendly letters and about like Christmas trees and a lot of different things. When we write about our feelings, she really helps me like think about how my feelings were at that time and it was really fun. Ms. Acedo is a really nice teacher because whenever we're doing eye station or eye ready, I ask her if I can go on the carpet and, s and she says yes. I love it when Ms. Acedo gives me choices because it helps me. She gives her best. She gives her undivided attention. She gives her personality. She gives her affection and love to students day in and day out. Ms. Asado has helped me grow tremendously, not just as a colleague, but as a friend. She's been there whenever I needed her. She's helped me see different ideas whenever I've had an emergency. She's been there for me, and I've been able to count on her and rely on her. Ms. Asado, I cannot thank you enough for everything that you've done as a colleague and as a friend. I'm very proud of you. <laughs> and I wish you nothing but the best. You are the lime to my lemon, and I cannot wait for the many more years that we have to share as colleagues. Have an amazing night, you deserve this. Tonight is your night.
Enjoy it. I feel like if you deserve this very, very much. Congratulations, have a nice time. Ms. Osado, thank you so much for teaching me this year. I really appreciated it. Keep up the great work. You were a very nice and awesome teacher this year. Congratulations. Mr. Rivera is the best teacher I've ever had because he's always there for every single one of his students and he's always, like, he just has a really charming personality and he's super funny and he, you can always, like, depend on him and he's not only become someone I can admire and look up to, but he's someone that I can trust and I can always come to him if I ever need anything. So what makes Mr. Rivera a truly effective teacher is his commitment to his students first and foremost and his knowledge of the content area that he is teaching. He is truly a master teacher, especially in the area of bilingual education. So not only do I count on Mr. Rivera, but you know, he is someone we can all count on here at our school. He is an active participant in the community. Any school function is, um, that we have here at our school, he is the first one to sign up and help. Not only does he focus on our current students right now, but he also focuses on other students, especially during his close-up program. At the end of the school year, he takes students to Washington, D.C. For my sixth grade teachers, I have Ms. Romo for writing, Mr. Rivera for reading and language arts, and Ms. Morales for math. My favorite story we have read in this class has to be War Horse. It's an exciting story. It really showed how horses were during World War I and the battles that they are part of. Another thing I like about Mr. Rivera is his sense of humor. He finds ways to make us laugh. The soldiers, of course, said Shmuel, as if this was the most obvious. Mr. Rivera makes the stories he reads to us come alive, and he teaches us a lot of life lessons. The banquet, or those of you going to uh, D.C. with me. We're all good? Okay. I know when I was in fifth grade, I, I just wanted to be in his homeroom class. All the other fifth grade friends that I have, they want to be in his class as well. Mr. Rivera, congratulations on being Teacher of the Year. You are very well deserving, and I wish you nothing but the best. Hey, Mr. Rivera, congratulations on winning the Teacher of the Year award. I hope you're having a great time. Mr. Rivera, I want to just congratulate you on everything, and everyone will really miss you, including me. And, you know, I just hope that you have a good time and you know, have fun teaching next year. Hey, Mr. Rivera, I hope you're having a wonderful evening so far. And I just want to say that it's been a privilege getting to know you, not only as a colleague, but I consider you a friend. You're very deserving of this, and I just hope you have a great evening. Ms. Sanchez helps me with things that are very hard to do. Which is such an amazing teacher is that she helps other students and myself different ways to learn language arts. Ms. Y. Sanchez, I want you to know that you have really helped us learn the different ways we can prepare ourselves to read and understand what we're reading. I also want to say that she is very funny and makes learning very fun during intervention. Ms. Sanchez is a fantastic teacher because she is always willing to support and to help the students here at Anthony Elementary. She is an amazing coworker. She is a team player, is always willing to support new teachers and even the teachers that have been here for many years. She is very supportive a love for her students. She is highly dedicated to early literacy and is one of our biggest supports here at Anthony Elementary School. She's amazing with the students. L, you, you, you up, uh, say it. And she helped me so much. She made reading interesting. I'm getting way better at it. So far, I managed to read a sentence on my own. Ready? Let me see your fingers. 
Mrs. Sanchez. Congratulations. I'm very happy for you. You have helped me with so many things. When I first tried to read something, I couldn't read the first syllable in the word, and you helped me so much. Congratulations. I'm happy for you. Ms. Sanchez, we are so happy for you. You totally deserve this. You have been an amazing friend to all of us. You have been a wonderful support. I have learned so much from you. We love you with all of our heart, and we hope that we can keep you in our school for many, many more years. You are a wonderful person and an awesome friend. Thank you for all of your support, all of your love. Thank you for always coming to work with a great smile. You're beautiful in the inside and outside. Yvonne, congratulations. You are an amazing teacher. You're amazing with our students and you've become such an amazing friend. I love you, Yvonne, and I look up to you in so many ways and you're such a good friend. Congratulations, Yvonne. Enjoy your night. Whenever we have big events, Coach Camacho helps out the teachers, give out toys and candy. He's always willing to help. He's very energetic, always willing to help my students, make sure they understand what he's trying to teach them. He, he likes to do hand over hand with them, teach them um, how to jump the rope, how to throw the ball. He will sit with them on the floor and roll balls with them. Um, some of my nonverbal students can't can say a word, but they know how to say coach. As soon as they see the picture, they say coach, coach, and they're happy to see him every day and always have time to talk to my students and ask them how their day has been going, what are they doing, how they feel, and I think my students like that, that attention from the coach. We're gonna miss them now that we're going separate ways. Um, I wish I could take you with me, coach. I'll never forget Coach Camacho because not only does he teach me PE, but he also taught me stuff that will help me in the real world. One of the things he's taught me is that someone is not always going to hold my hand in the real world, so I'm going to have to be independent sometimes. Coach Camacho, thank you for helping me. Thanks to you, now I'll be a better person. Coach Camacho, I hope you're having a good evening. Enjoy it. You deserve it. You're the best. You're number one for the SEC team. My students are gonna miss you, uh, and I hope that wherever you go, they appreciate all the things that you do for the special ed community. Hey, Coach Cabacho, congratulations on your award. Keep it up. Hey, bye. Now you'll have to show me your hair, okay? All of our friends are here today. Are you okay? All right, can you just have a... You got it, Mateo! What's your name? Yeah, Lenny. Yeah, Lenny, how old are you? Eight. What is your favorite thing about school? Uh, I like playing with the dogs. Uh, toys like and backpacks and my jacket. I like breakfast and rainbows. Hello, my name is Sandy Silvas. I'm the assistant principal for the Northern On Track Pre-K and also for the 3Y program at Desert Pride. Ms. Mendoza Flores is an amazing educator. I've known her for uh, several years. Right, so let's start with what job is this? Working with young children reminds us of how amazing and exciting the world can be, but it also takes a special teacher. She inspires her students to want to learn 
become independent thinkers and she knows her students very well. She uses every opportunity for learning. During her transitions, she has a fun way for students to break words into syllables using their body parts. Remember, these are three-year-olds turning four and they do it with ease. These students know what to do in her classrooms. She has empowered them and made them independent thinkers. I love my teacher. What's your favorite thing about your teacher? Miss Naya, she played me. I, I like my school because it's my favorite. Love. I love you, Miss Naya. <laughs> Ms. Naida, I want to congratulate you on this night. You deserve it. You are an amazing teacher. You create a learning environment where they feel safe to learn and explore. You are truly a unique teacher. I love you, Ms. Naida. Congratulations. I'm Savina and I'm in third grade and I go to Mesquita Elementary School. Hello, I'm Roxy Nicole Caro. I'm a sixth grader and I go to Mesquita Elementary School. My name is Lizette Gonzalez. I am a SPED inclusion instructional assistant at Mesquita Elementary. Hello, my name is Javier Yanez. I am the sixth grade teacher here at Mesquita Elementary. What makes Ms. Avila an amazing teacher? I believe it's the uh, professionalism, uh, the empathy that she has for her students, the communication she shares with her parents, and just the overall respect that she has for her work, her colleagues. Ms. Avila is a special teacher because every time when we were in class and I would need help with my subtraction, she would always help me and show me these new tricks to help okay, me. Does everyone agree with that? Yes. Good job. All right, so make sure that you have both. You need to She have... makes me feel confident. Whenever I would have trouble at my house or something's going on, she would always help me and she would always, and I mean always, she would talk to me about it. She is here to support each child individually. As my practicum mentor, which was great because I learned a lot from her, she was able to show me how to do lesson plan. She would guide me. If I did something good, she would acknowledge that. She's just a great person. Miss Avilad is a fantastic teacher because she has always been such a confident person and always makes people laugh. I had her for second and third grade and she always made every activity fun and she treated everyone fair. Heather, you are well deserving of this recognition. You are the teacher of the year, but you're more than that. You've accomplished so many things. I'm very proud of you. I am happy to call you my friend. Congratulations, Heather. I am really proud of you. Miss Avelad, you really earned this night, and I am glad that you were the one that was Teacher of the Year because you really earned it, and I hope you have a great night. I'm very happy that you were Tiana's second grade teacher. She loved you and she learned a lot. Thank you for everything you do. You're a great friend, coworker, and teacher. You're the greatest coworker, mentor, and friend. Thank you, Ms. Avalad, for being such a great teacher. Congratulations, enjoy your night. What makes Mr. Hernandez a great educator is he will always take the time to be there for you and come for you when you're not feeling the best. 
One thing me and Mr. Hernandez have in common is we like to talk about LeBron a lot and we like to talk about sports, LeBron, and he has taken the time to go support me at my own games. What makes Mr. Hernandez an outstanding teacher is that he's very professional, kind, caring, and most of all, he's always looking out for other people. What makes Mr. Hernandez a special teacher is that he's a very fun teacher. He's very likable to speak with. When I first started at this school, I felt bored with science. I didn't like science at all, but he made science engaging and fun to learn. You guys, the best education, the best science. Mr. Hernandez is an extraordinary teacher. He has a famous phrase, everything is going to be all right. And when he says that, I believe it. He's the, the kind of person that tries to reach out to all the kids, but in particular, the kids that typically don't participate in activities in school. Mr. Hernandez always finds the good in everyone. I remember one time when I was in classroom, he went and told the whole classroom, if you want to be a good middle school teacher, you gotta be a fun teacher. You gotta make it people love you and engage on your, themselves on the, your subject. Thank you so much for being the, one of the greatest teacher, if not the best teacher I ever had on science. Thank you so much for re-engaging me with your subject. Keep it up, Mr. Hernandez. Mr. Hernandez, what I want you to know is that although you are a Cowboy fan and I'm a Steeler fan, you know very well that we're a great team. We still do great together. Congratulations, Mr. Hernandez. You really do deserve this and enjoy this day and go out and celebrate. Hey, Mr. Hernandez, I just wanted to congratulate you on getting the award of Teacher of the Year. I appreciate you so much and I hope you continue doing big things in your life. Josh, congratulations. But I think we still should recount those votes for Teacher of the Year. Te quiero mucho. Felicidades.